Kelly, what on earth has been going on with you lately? I've done nothing but field phone calls about you all afternoon. I don't know. People are probably just jealous of how awesome I am. Oh yeah. Sure. That's got to be it. Who's been bugging you anyway? You should have just told them to call me. Oh wait, I have no credit. You should buy me some more credit. You don't get it at all, do you? Get what? Look, I got a call from Office Works. Apparently you spent $800 on a gaming headset and gaming chair. Oh great, they have come in. You really ordered that stuff. I need it for uni. And how are you going to pay for it all? Well, I was kinda hoping you might help out there. For a gaming chair? It's not a gaming chair, mom. It's an office chair, they just market it that way. Anyway, I will pay you back. With what money? With the money I earn from work, duh. Yes, well, about that. Your boss called me earlier today, to make sure you were okay. Oh, that was nice. Not really. He was calling to make sure you were okay, because you haven't been turning up to work. Apparently you missed three shifts in a row. I didn't miss those shifts, I was just busy. You don't get to be busy and just miss work. Anyway he says that if it happens again, he is going to fire you, and he is going to invoice you for the online graphic design course that your workplace paid for. He can't do that. He can't invoice me for work training. I thought the same, but it seems you signed a contract with him which said that if you did not stay with the firm and work your required shifts for six months after the training, you agree to repay the amount spent on that training. I don't understand why everyone is being so unreasonable today. It's just like the time you got fired from your job at the bank. Yeah. An old lady came into the bank and asked me to check her balance. So I pushed her over. Oh we are hilarious.